Hey YouTube, Kira Qualia here, bringing you all another Card Fight Vanguard Overdress standard game. Today's matchup is Majesty Lord Blaster versus Dragonic Overlord. I have my buddy Anthony playing Dragonic Overlord on the right. With the newer support we got from the Festival Booster getting plenty of reprints, I figured a match was due just to showcase some of the cards for the game. So let's go ahead and get started. We will draw. I'm going to put one back. Same here. And then I have dice as well to determine who will go first. Four. Three. Three. I will go first. All right. Stand, Stand up. up. Vanguard. I will draw. I will discard one. To ride Little Sage Marin. Uh, no ability of anything else, so go ahead. Drop the turn. Hmm. Right? Yep. Uh, skill of Wundu. Draw one card. And attack. I will no guard. Check. Damage check. All effects fair. Go ahead. I will draw for turn. I will discard one. I will ride Blaster Dark. I will use Little Sage Marin skill when wrote upon. I look at the top seven cards of my deck. Six and seven. And I can add up to one card with Blaster and its card name, but sadly there is no card. Darn. So if I did not reveal a card, I call Wing All Brave for my soul out to the field. That's not how that works. Is that not how it works? No, it's a similar thing with Avant Garda. Uh, you can either reveal the card, look at the top, or actually, how's it, it worded? It said if you did not reveal a card, choose a Wingle Brave from your soul and call, you may call to rear guard. Oh. Okay, well, we'll just go with that. Yeah, because yeah. that's how the Blaster Dark justification works for the deck, because then you can call this out and use the Soul Blast 1 Retire to then gain the additional drive check. Oh, I see. So he has the drive check plus one. I think I'll just have to reread Alvin Garter or look it up yeah. or something, I think. And then you get to drive plus one. So then I will attack your vanguard for ten. Take Blaster it. Dark. First check. And second check. And then it'll be your go. Draw. Right. Uh, skill. When he's run upon by an Ahalum, can I plus one, switch my deck. For up to one, grade one, reveal it, and put it into my hand. I am going to add... Are there any other interesting targets? Oh, yes. Uh, I'm going to add Drag Ritter High Bay. Is that what it's Yeah, that's what I've been calling it. Get up. I'm going to call and call. I'll have Nahalum attack your vanguard. No guard. Damage check. Ooh. All effects to my vanguard. Well, that's not fun. Well, the attack won't hit, so go ahead. All right, I will stand and draw. I will discard one to ride Majesty Lord Blaster. So I will then call Cordelia to the back row center rear guard. It gets all the ability that's in the back row center rear guard of Majesty Lord Blaster. It gives, if my opponent's back, eh, they're not at a 3-3, so the boost won't matter, but I will call out Blaster Blade and Blaster Dark. I will, uh, no skills of either. But I will call a Fasado as well. Okay. I will enter battle, attacking for 10 with Blaster Blade to your Vanguard. No guard that. I will attack with Majesty Lord Blaster using skill to place Blaster Blade and Blaster Dark into the soul. He gets drive plus one. And I choose a rear guard of yours and retire, so I'll retire your Gojo. No and guard. Then Oh wait, does he get an this extra critical? Yes, he does have an extra critical. So it's oh. an extra critical with triple drive. 
Oh, then in that case, I will perfect guard that. Okay. Triple drive first, second, and third. Draw trigger, giving the power to Fasado, and I draw one. Okay. At the end of the battle, that Cordiella boosted. I can counter blast one, choosing two units, one blaster blade and one blaster dark from my soul, and call them out to rear guard. Hmm. And then I will attack your vanguard with blaster dark for 10. I'll intercept. And then 23 with Fasada. Check. No trigger. Fasada skill on hit, counter charge, and soul charge. And it's your go. Draw. Right. The end. Uh, put upon by a card with an overlord in his name. Call this card to rear guard. I will call, using a skill to retire him. Put a grade three with Overlord as same for my drop zone into soul. Call. Skill of Burning Horn Dragon. Look at the top seven cards in my deck. Reveal up to one card with Overlord in his name, add to hand. And if I did not reveal, counter charge. Okay. And seven. I did find one. Scale of a hollow. Soul Blast 1. Giving plus 5,000 power to both himself and the Vanguard. Okay. So let's see. First, I will attack your Vanguard with the end. For 18? Yes. No guard. Twin Drive check. Heal trigger. Recover 1. Giving the 10,000 power to my Overlord. Second check. Critical. The crit to my van and giving the power to Nahalem. Damage check. First check. Second check. Draw trigger, giving the power to my vanguard, and I draw one. Skill of my vanguard. Counter boss one. Discard two. This card counts as two when he's discarded. Yep. Restand. And since I have a Dragonic Overlord in soul, he does not lose a drive check. Okay. Attacking the vanguard for 28 into critical. I will. I will perfect guard that attack. I will discard this facade. Twin drive. Critical trigger. I'm giving all the effects to Burning Horn Dragon. It's really fearing that over trigger. Uh, burning Horn attack with Burning Horn Dragon to Vanguard for 25. Did it get another additional plus 5 from the attack? Because each time it attacks, it gets plus 5. Oh, I thought it was just a main plus 5. So, so that would be 30 to Van with a card. my 23, I will intercept with Blaster Dark. Oh, actually, I don't want to intercept with Blaster Dark. You said 30, correct? Yes. I'll guard with Perovi. She gets plus 5, putting her at 33. Okay. Now, will you guard the Blaster Dark? For mm -hmm. I'll think. let it go for that one. Okay. So it's your go. I will stand and draw. I will Persona Rhyme. Yep. And then I will call Mugain. Mm -hmm. When placed with a Vanguard Blaster, discarding a card from my hand, I check two cards from the top of my deck, call up to two units from among them. There's two units, aren't there? There is a Blaster Dark, calls it as rest, and I discard the rest. So I will, it says choose up to two, so then I'll just mm -hmm. discard the rest. Okay. So I will swap Blaster Dark with Blaster Blade. And then I will enter battle. Yep. I will attack your Vanguard for 20,000 with Blaster Blade. How many cards are in your drop? There are one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten exact. Guard. Okay. I will attack with Majesty Lord Blaster, boosted by Cordiella, using the skill of both to put Blaster Blade and Blaster Dark into the soul. He gets the retire effect, so I will retire your Burning Horn. And he gets drive plus one. 
So it is. I'm just gonna perfect. Okay. Perfect. Triple drive. First, second, and third. Heal trigger. Heal does go off, giving the power to Fosado, and I heal one. Mm -hmm. Then at the end of the attack, Cordiella, counter blasting one, to call out Blaster Dark and Blaster Blade. I will use Blaster Blade skill, counter blasting one, choosing one of your grade two or greater rear guards and retiring it. And then I will attack Cordiella's skills since you have a grade three Vanguard. All my grade twos get boost, so I'll boost Blaster Dark with Blaster Blade for no trigger effect, but if your rear guard wasn't retired, so it's 30,000 to your Vanguard. Check, no trigger. And then Fasado attacks, I gave the trigger boost here, so it'd be 41 to your Vanguard. Check. And then skill, counter charge one, and soul charge one. I just have Blaster Darks in my soul, so he doesn't have the permanent 2k boost. So it is your go. Drop. Persona ride. Call, call. Yep. First, my Vanguard will attack your Vanguard for 28. No extra critical, correct? No extra critical. I'll take the Vanguard. Twin drive check. Over trigger. Okay. Now we have We're standing on to deal with. Given the million power to my Vanguard, I draw one for the over trigger. Second check, heal trigger. Recovering one, giving 10,000 power to this Brachio over here. Yep. Damage check. I'll attack again with my Vanguard. I will have to no guard that. Twin drive check, draw trigger, <laughs> giving the power to this Brachio and drawing. Second check. Damage trigger check. Vanguard scale, counter blast one, discard two units, restand, attack Vanguard again. There is a couple heals still left in the deck, I believe, so I will have to no guard this one as well. Check, heal trigger, yeah, okay, no you recovery, get the heal trigger. the power here. Critical trigger, crit to Van, power to Brachio. Okay, there's still two heals left in deck, so damage check. Sadly, no, I couldn't <laughs> block it. I had no peaches left in my hand. But that is it for the game. I hope you all enjoy. Definitely a crazy matchup, especially when you can get those over triggers at the perfect timing, like Dragonic Overlord always can. Hope you all enjoyed. And as always, until next time, please don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And Kira Qualia out.